Hello and welcome to this quick introduction to Opera simulation software and its use in the design of transformers. Opera has been in commercial development since 1984. In 2018, Opera joined Dassault System as part of the Simulia brand. So let's start with the very basics of transformers. In the ideal world, different windings on primary and secondary circuits produce transform voltages and currents on the output compared to the input, according to very simple calculations. But in the real world, you have a less than 100% flux linkage. Hence, you have flux leakages to consider in both a primary and secondary. When designing a real-life transformer, a certain amount of leakage may be desirable. When designing air gaps or magnetic bypass shunts to limit short circuit currents that it will supply. In addition to the leakage flux, the coils would be made of less than perfect conductors. Therefore, you have copper losses to deal with. And in the core, you'll have magnetizing reactants and losses from the iron. All of these deviations from the perfect transformer can be expressed as equivalent circuit parameters and are often used in transformer specification. When it comes to assessing the performance of a prospective transformer, three tests are commonly carried out. These can be reproduced in the virtual world using simulation to calculate the parameters that we see here. If you've taken the designs as far as you can with hand calculations, test-based processes and analytical methods and need to turn to more accurate and versatile techniques to provide the insights necessary to design better transformers, finite element analysis provides the accuracy that you need. Simulation provides you with means to replicate those tests virtually, saving time and money, and giving you also additional insights which we list on the slide here. Opera offers a range of FEA modules, enabling accurate, robust solution of multi-physics problems in low and high frequency electromagnetics, thermal and stress domains. It also has a fully integrated optimizer. Opera is based on a scripting language, augmented with Python, which allows automation of all of the steps in the modeling process and customization of the user environment. So with the option to create any shape of device, add nonlinear properties plus any shape of magnets and coils, and any generic electronic circuit, you can define a model of virtually any type of transformer or electrical machine in general. You're not limited to analytical representations. You're mainly limited by the capability of your hardware to solve the resulting matrices. But what about conceptual design? How can designers without years of analysis experience utilize the techniques we've shown to virtually try out design rapidly? Well, we've produced a transformer environment that captures the many years of analysis knowledge of our engineers and automates the process of analyzing common machine configurations. It functions with the ease of use of analytical software that solve the resulting problems using accurate finite element analysis techniques. The transformer environment uses a wizard style data entry for ease of use. It's written in the COMI language that we mentioned earlier, so it's not merely a closed executable. Common types of configurations are offered, but the command files are mainly open source, so the user is free to make adjustments to the standard command file. This could be a small tweak to a geometrical shape, right through to a completely new topology of winding. Relevant data in terms of standard parameters is gathered for the transformer being analyzed, then the environment builds a full fidelity finite element model. Analyses are submitted automatically to the batch processor, then standard post-processing commands automatically generate plots and reports such as efficiency ratios, losses, and inductances. The transformer environment is launched from the standard 3D Opera GUI. First, you select whether you want a transformer or a reactor. If you've defined a transformer already, and want to continue working with it, you have the option to pick up the geometry from an existing file. Otherwise, you can start generating the geometry afresh, automatically using the environment. Several standard configurations are available. After you've selected one, you can give some basic topological information. Choose whether you want to include details in the model, such as the air gaps, the tank, the clamps, leg plates, and bolts. The more details that you choose to add, the greater the number and types of results you can extract, but probably at the cost of more elements and hence longer run times. Once you've chosen the basic topology, you are presented with a series of dialogues to enter the geometrical information, both for the legs of the transformer and for the coils. You can choose by default from solenoids and racetracks and can split them automatically into a number of subwindings. If you choose to include air gaps and support structure in the model, you'll be presented with dialogues to enter geometrical information for the appropriate components also. It's easy to generate a number of air gaps in the legs if you're investigating the effect of such features in a new design. Once you've a representation of the device, you select which test you'd like to perform. 
The default options are open circuit, short circuit and inrush, the three tests that we mentioned earlier. Each test will generate the appropriate circuit definition and drive the transformer as per the real world test. Results generated for each test are shown in the table on the right hand side of the slide. Note that this is generating a standard output model for Opera. So if you have some non-standard tests, you can edit the driving function or circuit connectivity to suit. At the outset, you have the option to tick a box to perform an optimization analysis. If you choose this option, you're presented with a dialog containing possible variables for the optimization run. Select any that you'd like to be considered a variable to be optimized or varied. For the inrush test, a full three-phase circuit is automatically defined and attached to the transformer. You can see the fully driven three-phase primary and load is secondary with resistance and inductance. Here we see typical resulting models. The top view shows the geometrical entities for the particular devices designed. You can see the tank and support structure as well as the transformer itself, complete with coils. The bottom view shows the model to be analyzed, complete with coils and mesh, including the air. You can see the grade of mesh where the elements increase in size away from the area of interest. When the model build is complete, the software lists the variables that you've declared for optimization and the outputs requested. For any of the results cases, you can use the post processor to investigate the behavior of your device. Results can be presented on individual components to investigate the efficiency of individual components as well as the device as a whole. At this point, you're probably thinking, uh, but my transformer is different, but we can cater for that because of the way that our environments are structured. As mentioned previously, the environments are largely open commi files. This means that you're not limited to purely the transformer configurations offered. You have two choices in using the environments for your own design that differ from those on offer in the prepackaged environment. Firstly, you can run the commi file, then at a chosen point, pause execution. Make changes to the model interactively, then continue with the operation. Or secondly, you can edit the commi file to account for your adjustments every time it operates. If you do the first of these, it's often a simple job to cut and paste the logged commands from the interactive session to create an edited commi file. In summary, we've seen during this presentation how Opera provides a fully functional analysis system for design of electromagnetic devices such as transformers in both 2D and 3D. Standard transformer templates can be used, defined by the advanced user or licensed from our industry experts. Opera models can be used in system level design. All of this is industry proven and supported by experts in the field of transformer design. Thank you for joining us for this quick overview. Please don't hesitate to contact us for more information or check the Opera or Dassault Systems websites for further details. Thank you.